guys welcome back to the channel my name is Roslyn this is your mom creations welcome today as you guys know today is the open house so I have to leave the house to let Tiffany Daniels who is my good friend and she's also the realtor who will be selling the home with this gentleman um, that will be uh, that's working for uh, Chase Bank they are going to do their thing so in the meantime I'm going to Walmart to see what they have in store while I'll be killing some times and let them have the house Hopefully when we come back, they will have some great news for us. So if you are new, thank you so much for watching today's video. And if you are a returning subscriber, thank you so much for all your support. Thank you for clicking again into my video. Thank you so much. So let's go ahead and go to Walmart, at least a Walmart in my neighborhood and see what they have for 2022 Christmas decor. I'm sure that you I'm sure that you guys have seen several uh, videos already from Walmart but you guys have not seen what we have right here in our store so let's go ahead and go to Walmart and see what they have in this in the store so yep wow at least Walmart here by my house they are very packed with those these ornaments they have all colors that you can think of everything oh wow that's those are a lot a lot of ornaments and uh, they have some pretty ones yes guys i love this one yes they do have a lot a lot of ornaments all colors and shape very very beautiful y'all guys i am not too sure if I am going to decorate for Christmas because if our house is on for sale and if we do have a contract a contract I'm not sure whether we are going to decorate but if I don't have a contract before Christmas I would I know that we are decluttering the house and we have to keep it light and airy but I would decorate lightly you know very light because i don't think that if i do not have a contract before christmas i can live with my house the way it is because christmas is the it's my favorite time of the year and i don't think i think it will be very depressing to not having christmas at least one christmas tree last year i went with i went all out but this year as I am going to my Christmas item and try to get rid of some stuff, but I will have one Christmas tree. I'm trying. I'm hoping that I don't have to because trust me, guys, if I have a contract, it will be a blessing from the sky. But if I don't have a, a contract um, before Christmas, I will put a Christmas tree up and I will decorate it very slightly and I will decorate the house very light and airy so that way i don't i won't have too much before i have a somebody come a showing so guys they did have a lot i love this one i love this um berry picks i think it's beautiful and for the price i think it's very affordable 199 and i know that i have a couple bundles in my hand but it looks full for one bundle at 199 and one other one that I love is this garland. I don't remember I saw this garland last year. They did have garland, but it did not have that much frosted and berries at the same time. So they did have a lot of items here. Very beautiful. And I don't remember I saw that last year. So, yeah. Very cute. Uh, Walmart by my house has a lot of stuff and people were coming and buying a lot as we were there. So the shelves, as they were packing them, packing them, they were um, getting empty. I love this little wig. It's um, very simple and cute. This is something that I would definitely, if I decorate for Christmas, that I will pick, pick up. So that way it's not too much, it's not too big, but it's very light. So, yeah, let's keep on moving on. Have you guys started decorating for Christmas? Or oh, do you guys still have your uh, four decors out still? Let me know in the comment below. And let me know if you are decorating for Christmas. If you already started. Or if you still have your um, four decor out. If 
that our house wasn't for sale my four decor will still be out and we will take them down maybe like a week before thanksgiving and then i will put my christmas tree up it has been a transition a tradition the day the night of thanksgiving so let me know if you are decorating for christmas have you started yet and what color are you going to decorate for christmas because i feel like if you don't have an inspiration from the year that's just me if i don't have an inspiration for the, from the year before it feels very confusing when you come to the stores and you see all these beautiful items it's hard for me to make a decision and pick up one color but most of the time i do pick out my colors uh, from the year before for from the after sale christmas sale so once i pick up a few items and the most item that i picked out from the 75 percent of walmart always always has uh after new year so that's when i usually pick up pick out my colors for the following year so guys let me know down below in the description box and let me know what color are you are going to decorate for christmas if you had already picked up your colors the year before or has it been a challenge to pick out the color what's your you know what exactly are you guys going to do i would love to know and they did have a lot of uh, wrapping papers very very cute guys sorry for the background noises guys if you guys hear any i don't know what's going on cars are coming and blowing their horn so this little pillow isn't that beautiful i love it this one will look very nicely on a bench and some green throw very very cute that is very different i love it so while we here i'm going to check um the candles and i love those jars they very cute and they were only 13.87 and of course i never stop and not checking the cheap the 3.99 ones because i love some of them has really don't be surprised they have some great scents they just don't last but they have some great scents and i always pick them up and decoy them inside a nice little tray and you cannot go wrong <laughs> so anyway while i'm here my son was looking for he wanted a bike so here is one bag that i see that i love for him but he doesn't know so i call my mom and send it to my mom and my mom says she's on her way and she came over and she got the bag for my son he doesn't even know my mom was looking for a bag and then the one that he really wanted was on sale so here is my son we calling him to go to the door to go check it out and he saw the wheel and he came right running to me thinking that i was the one who purchased it for him so uh yeah so i told him it's my mom so he went it was so much noise in the house and the dogs barking and everything so yeah he's so happy he's going around to go see the bike and i'm not even sure he knows how to ride the two wheels yet because last time he had a bag it was a four wheels and now it is a two wheels so yeah after my mom got the bike from a walmart she took it home with her and today is sunday morning she came home and bought the bike to my son uh, she hid it behind the door and we told my son to go open the door as soon as he saw the wheel he came hugging me i told him no you gotta go to my mom my mom is the one who got it so he was so excited he is him in the back trying to um ride the back <laughs> but it is a struggle i do need to go get him a helmet and some knee pads so thank you guys for watching today's video thank you so much for hanging out with me and my family i will see you very soon in the next one until next time guys be safe and be blessed bye y'all